Hey guys, today we talk about my top five Jordan brand releases coming up in December 2017. Tune in. Welcome to Custom Station where we talk sneakers. My name is Zoe, and if you're here for the first time, make sure you hit that subscribe button and even that notification bell so you don't miss any dope sneaker content. The topic you've all been waiting for, my top five Jordan brand releases that are coming up in December 2017. Man, oh man, a lot of Jordans are coming out, like a whole lot of Jordans are releasing. I was like, why not make a video on my top five Jordan releases for this month? So without any more talking, let's get into it, people. So number five on my list is the Jordan 6 UNC. I like these sneakers right here. They definitely have that same color blocking of the infrared Jordan 6s, and I like that colorway as well. Simply, it's a red replacing a blue, or I got that backwards, a blue replacing a red, and I like that simple elegance to the sneaker. I'll likely be trying to cop these sneakers this month of December. So number four on my list is the Air Jordan 1 Rust Pink. Initially, we had seen that Nigel Sylvester had gave us a glimpse of those sneakers while he was riding his bike, which is really dope, and I love his videos, by the way. But anyways, those sneakers are nice, and I like that they have that little aesthetic of pink on it. You don't normally see that with Jordan 1s, and they did it in the right color blocking where it wasn't overwhelming the sneaker. And you guys already know, I love my Air Jordan 1s. That's an essential shoe you can wear with anything, and I mean anything. Unfortunately, these Air Jordan 1 Rust Pinks are going to be releasing exclusively at Art Basel in Miami, along with the Igloo Air Jordan 1s. Man, I wish I had the cash money to fly over to Miami and cop those sneakers, but hopefully Jordan Bland, Jordan Bland, Jordan Brand is just hopefully messing with us and, you know, building up the hype for the sneakers so we can hopefully get a general release. Number three on my list, another Air Jordan 6. Bars! The Air Jordan 6 Gatorade. And I'm not talking about those ugly green ones. I'm talking about the ones that resemble the Carmines. The orange color way in this particular sneaker is dope sauce. I love it. I can't wait till these sneakers come out because I'm definitely going to be trying to cop. There are certain OG Jordans that if you literally just copy the sneaker and just replace the color blocking with one different color instead of the original color color, the sneaker is automatically dope. Number two are the Air Jordan 5 Bordeaux. A lot of premium Jordan 5s have come out this year and I've passed on every single one of them because either the color blocking for me was not, you know, a nice color blocking or just frankly, the sneaker was too gosh darn expensive. 400 bucks Jordan, come on bro. But anyways, I love this sneaker because they have the right amount of the or dull colorway on this sneaker. As you've noted in my previous videos, I personally don't like when there's Bordeaux on the upper of the sneaker and then the midsole has like a different offsetting color. I personally don't like that. In this particular instance, this sneaker has Bordeaux all throughout and it has that translucent outsole that I really, really adore. And all together, the sneaker came together nicely. And number one on my list, I'm definitely copying this if I have the opportunity, is the Air Jordan. Jordan 9 NRG boots. A lot of people are probably looking at me like, Bleh. but I love this sneaker. This is a dope sneaker for the fall and winter season, and I love the combination of brown, black, and that little tinge of red at the heel or the back portion of this particular sneaker. This is my number one. I'm definitely copying, guys. Anyways, guys, that's all I have for you guys today. Please remember to like comment share and subscribe and also let me know down in the comment section what are your top jordan releases that you're aiming to purchase or aiming to get this december 2017 i appreciate you guys and i'll see you guys all in the next episode of casa station deuces